Hello and welcome back to my let's play on Total War Shogun 2 with the Takeda on Legendary Difficulty. Well, last time we left off, we were expanding around Kyoto. We've taken Setsu. We have to repair the castle now. I have to rebuild this up to the Magistrate instead and then we can start finally recruiting our Metsuke. We'll be able to recruit, I think, like three or four of them. We got... Uh, we definitely have three. Yeah, Marcus there. I don't think I've got any other Marcus, so I can definitely recruit three of them. Omi might have a... No, we don't. We already own Omi. I, I thought we still had to take this for some reason, but no, we own Omi. Doesn't have a market though. Um, could I build a market? Yes, I could. I think I will. I would like. I'd need some more Metsuke. And also, actually, uh, Omi is one of the richer towns we're going to own for a while, so we're definitely going to use this as one of our main uh, Metsuke settlements, so we should definitely have a market in there. Yeah, Setsu is the highest, and Kaga. Setsu is the highest because it has a fucking rice exchange, probably, but... Uh, Kaga, Omi, and then we've got a cheese and, and North Shinano. North Shinano, yeah. It, when North Shinano is one of your richest towns, something's gone wrong. <laughs> um, I mean, at some point we'll take Sado, that'll be rich. We've got Izu down here, that'll be, that is actually already very, very rich. They've upgraded that fully, that's nice. And then we can make some more money making buildings there, too. Awari is also really rich. We'll take that eventually, once we're on the right triggers. Which again, we have no idea when that's going to happen, because we don't know how much our fame is. Um, I think we can take a couple more towns, but we do have to start being careful soon, because I don't... I really don't want to trigger it yet, but it's just... it could very easily happen at this rate. Um, right, I can reach Iga like that. That's what I figured I would be able to do. I could also attack Omi. Uh, sorry, Kawachi, even. That's selecting the stupid agents. Oh, because otherwise I can't. Okay, I have to attack the army. That doesn't matter. Uh, but I think I said I was going to do that with the army in Setsu anyway. Because we could set, certainly be both of them. I think I said I might try and sabotage one of them, which is still a possibility. Don't we have a ninja around here? No, it's over here, right. Uh, oh yeah, because Kikawa should have an army around here somewhere. There it is. Hello. Okay. I might want to take them out first and then just run back into Setsu. Instead of dealing with the Hatakiyama right now. I also wonder if they want to peace out with me, because they have only got one town left. I don't actually want to, I will just... No, okay, they don't even want to. If they if they would want to, I would have probably still just... Um, just taken their town. Uh, because I don't want that... I don't want them as a vassal. Uh, we can trade with the Honma, or the Sagara. I think we, we traded with the Honma before, and then they broke it a turn later. But I think we got like free ground out of it, so... Well, they don't want to trade now. Sagara, you have Sometimes more horses. Will you still pay me? And not really. Shall we see what our Rich journeys Coker? have in store yeah. for us? Uh, I mean, it's better than no trade, so yeah, sure. <laughs> Get another fucking alliance. They're all into the Shoni. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, it's money. Unless the trade is blockaded, in which case it's not money. And it would be kind of annoying. What would you want from me? 120. I mean, trade. I'll make that back in a single turn, so I guess it is technically worth it, unless my trade is blockaded, or theirs is, which I guess I could probably see right now. Theirs isn't, and it would probably go to here, so mine wouldn't be either. It is blockaded here, losing all trade. Ito, Cheskabi, and Amako from the fucking Kikawa. Alright, well, let me murder this army and see if they want to peace out. I find it highly unlikely, yeah, but hey, you never know. Uh, okay, I could attack the town. I could also sabotage that army instead and then just take the town from behind them. I don't know how to... Well, the thing is, I just don't want it to run away. If I attack them, I could easily auto resolve it, but it, if they run away, it could be really annoying. And I don't want to waste any movement because I want to run back into Setsu next turn, otherwise I get fucked here. So yeah, I'm going to sabotage them. I will run next to it first. Hopefully I have enough movement left. Oh, just about. My god, that must have been close. Alright, so then we attack him. We auto resolve him out of existence. Lost 166 men. Not too shabby. Weird lag is happening again. What the? I don't know what's going on with that. I know, um... Darren Total War, what's his name? Uh, Republic of Play, that's his name nowadays. That's well, been for a while. Uh, he, um... He had some really crazy issues with Shogun 2 at some point as well. Not too long ago. I think he even bought a new PC because of it. But yeah, mine go away after 20 seconds. His, I think, stayed. And became a real problem. So 
So I don't know if they're related at all, but uh, there you go. Alright, there's another market. We can probably keep that one too. So currently this has 5. It's going to have 6, 7, plus 4. So 11. It's going to be pretty damn unhappy, but we could probably exempt this from taxes. I, I want to go back into Setsu either way. Right, do you want to piece that? You know, I've taken your town. One of your... One of your many towns now. Speak, if you must. But speak carefully, if you value your tongue. Hmm. They would take peace if I gave them my son. Can I trust them? Unlikely. Their integrity is questionable, and their temperament is ambitious, so... Probably not. They're also at Wardia Tano, who are also in this area. So yeah, probably not. I don't think I want to risk that. Uh, right, yeah, so trade with you, that's what I was looking at. So, 178. Um, I would make it back. Yeah, all right, I'll pay you. So but I'll pay you less than what you asked What have you to say today? Will my ears be shamed by the hearing? Fucking hell. They're not messing around. They they actually want what, I, what they asked for. There you go, I shaved off 10 Koku. Wow, what a fucking deal. There you go, bud. Enjoy that. Uh, and actually, let me check the Kikawa again. Let me just see if I if they would take so if they value trade at all. What have you to say today? Uh, if I Will do this, my ears be no, I still, I still need to add theory. this in. So they wouldn't even pay me for trade or anything. So now nah, fuck you, now nah, fuck you, now nah, fuck you. Uh, right. So do we take out? I think we do take out the Atano right now. How happy is Omi? Very happy. Good. All right. Let's take out the Atano. <laughs> I do risk these guys attacking me and Omi. Which would be a little bit annoying, actually. Didn't really consider that too well. Although they are not allied nor at war with the Ashikaga Shogunate, so they can't actually go through this territory. They have to go like that, so they can't. They can't. Oh, there's another army here as well. Did we? Oh, this is the army we defeated. And then they survived. Oh, that's kind of annoying, actually, how much survived. Their replenishment's pretty meh, though. That's good. Um, cool, and we got another market here, so we actually have all of our markets ready. And in three turns, we can get good-ass ninjas, although we have... How many ninjas do we have right now? Uh, how the fuck do you check this again? It's been a while. We have three ninjas, one of them is level one. He's just not done anything yet, no. Okay, so I definitely can make two more level three ninjas, and then I could replace that one, too, if I wanted to. We were building a or a um, monastery thingy here, right? So we need to one more turn before I can get that. We have 400 Bakarinos. I honestly think it wouldn't be a bad idea to just recruit a bunch of Yari Ashigaru here and keep them in the east just in case. Oh. Right, so the Honma took that. I'm gonna go chase that army. I wanna see what the plan is here. If they can make it. It's not here. Wait, which way did they go? Did they go down this way? Well, I guess we'll find out next turn then. Um, yeah, let's uh, let's just recruit let's just recruit one Yari Ashigaru here. Do we? Yeah, let's just start slowly building that army up a little bit. Just funnel a couple units that way because that'll that'll make a huge difference. All right, cool. So, really, I just want to take these three towns and then kind of peace out people around here or just protect our borders and then we go east and pre like start preparing for realm divide now that i can get my metskis out as well or soon anyway we can start making bank and then we can start upgrading all the buildings required i mean we have the best infantry you could possibly recruit here already but i just need to get more buildings so i can recruit more of them i need to get the monastery so you know we're doing tax reform then i'm going to go for way of the bow and then i'm going to go for that so it's still a ways away but you know uh, and here as well, we have all the best upgrades that we can get. Like, well, we can get higher here, but that's not going to happen. So we can get the best units, we just need to be able to actually recruit them. And then over here, next turn, we can start recruiting Fire Cap, which is probably going to be predominantly what we use. So for the most part, we have the building, we have the technology. Um, yeah, for the most part, we're actually ready um, to start recruiting. We just need the money and we need a couple more buildings. Anyway, um, which makes me even wonder more if this is worth it. I think what I'll do is I'll actually just save the money and start recruiting Katana Samurai, and then I'll send them this way, but they'll eventually just replace the Katana Samurai and Yari Shigaru in these armies. Yeah, that makes more sense. I'm not, I don't feel the need to recruit an army too fast yet. 
I think it might have, like, I could very easily get declared warm by someone and feel a lot of pressure all of a sudden. Oh fuck, the Date. The return of the Date, holy shit. Um, yeah, I could start feeling a lot of pressure all of a sudden, but for the moment I think we're okay. Oh yeah, we're allied to the Shusukabe, aren't we? <laughs> I threw that one in for good measure, didn't I? Oh, what the fuck. This campaign is crazy. Actually, some people, um, <laughs> they... I think one of them said, uh, like, on purpose, tinfoil hat, but, uh, it could be that the developers patched Shogun 2 to make the AI weaker so that people would start uh, playing their newer games. And, uh, oh, they're attacking... No, I'm fucking... Well, actually, I'm downgrading that, so I'm not sure if that's going to do anything. Um, oh, no, this guy's going to try and cause a rebellion. That would be kind of annoying if she's... Oh, no, he's going to go for my monk. Right, that's also annoying. He is failing, though. Thank fuck for that. Anyway, yeah, so I, I, I don't think that's the case. They did patch it recently. There was a whole fucking... Like, thing around that, in that they removed the uh, Yari sex chats. Nice! <laughs> that, oh, fuck the Yamanuchi on the offensive as well. What the fuck's going on? Uh, there was a... Yeah, there was a thing. They, they removed the, um, the Yari sex chats thing from the multiplayer in Shogun 2. Had been there since the beginning. Bit of outrage from that. Personally, I don't see the problem. But... I'm not going to get into that, because... Oh no, I lost all this trade. Oh my god, stop. Oh, that negative shit, Jesus Christ. Give me some positive notes. Um, yeah, so, yeah, things are... Things were happening, but uh, as far as I'm aware, there was no actual patch uh, for the game itself. And I, I don't think CA would do things like that. Also, the Mogami are uh, running back to take back their town from the Date. I don't know why they haven't just finished them off yet, to be honest. It's kind of ridiculous. Um, but yeah, okay, so the Yamanuchi took this place down here. Their army got kind of beaten up doing it, though. And then... Satomi owned that. Like the Hom the Hojo are actually down to just these... We're actually bordering someone who we're not allied with or anything, so this could be bad. I'm gonna send my ninja down this way. I'm gonna follow this path because I want to get the information around here. Uh, but yeah, I don't think anyone was actually serious about that either. But you know, it was just kind of funny, like putting on my tinfoil hat here. But uh, what if they fucked up the game on purpose? Oh, look at that golden charge! I mean, we don't even have a fully upgraded jet, so I don't know why it's gold. But whatever. Um. But anyway. There you go. I need to exempt this place. Right, so they fucked up the building. Yeah, it got removed. <laughs> that, did, that didn't do anything. I, I was I was, I was, was demolishing it anyway. That's fucking hilarious. Um, okay. I actually am very tempted to recruit some... Uh, okay, I want to get another monk. Let's recruit some fire cab now. Because... Oh, oh, look at them stats. That's, that's a thing of beauty right there. I want to get another monk as well. I do need to get two more uh, archers. I was going to put those in uh, this army anyway. And then we have three of them, yeah. So we'll, we'll keep doing that. 761, I can't recruit anything else with. Um, this place is getting happier in a couple turns. Why are we getting two happiness from this? Does the castle just give you two? Oh yeah, it gives you two more, okay. Um, I honestly al almost never build castles, which is why I'm like confused. All of our farms are about to be done as well. That's going to be great. Our food, our income is going to start flying up pretty soon. It's, well, it's not going to fly up. It doesn't go that fast, but it's, yeah, definitely going to grow a lot faster. Because right now we're getting seven. Um, yeah, the plus four and minus four are canceling each other out. So basically zero, and then you get the global food supply. Seven growth per turn. Um, that's going to go up to 15 growth per turn in every single town. Like, obviously it's not always the same, because here we have minus four, but only plus two. But, like... There's plus 7, that's going to become plus 15 in every single town. Um, and I've done, I've explained this before, but in, just in case people don't understand, growth is, uh, like, you have your province wealth, that's the amount of growth you've amassed, essentially. Uh, and then you get 18% of that, if the tax rate is 18%, of course, it depends on the town, some of them might be higher. Once we get our Metsu case, it'll be higher, and once we get uh, tax reform, it's going to be 5% higher as well. Um, so it'll be 23%, and then you gain uh, more from Metsuke's. But let's say right now it's 18%. So I grow 15 wealth in one town where I have 18% uh, tax rate. That means that after one turn, I would make another... God, what's 18? Well, okay, let's say 20% just because it's easier math. So one-fifth of 15, so free Koku. We would make free Koku more per turn from every single town that we own. 
per turn. So that's gonna that actually does feel like it's flying up. Let's say we have twenty. Well, we don't have twenty tons yet, but we have like we have fifteen tons right now. So three times fifteen, forty-five. So we our income would increase by forty-five every turn, and that's just gonna keep going up. And there's nothing else that's changing that. That's just going up. There's no downside to that. Um. So yeah, it's pretty baller. If we're being honest with one another. Hence why I. Uh, why I always say that uh, having food surplus is really good. And why I don't usually build free castles. This is actually the highest. I think this might be the most castles I've ever built. I haven't even built this one yet. I need to still need to build this one. Anyway, uh, yes, let's get the monk out. Let's do it. Uh, and then... That's it in terms of recruitment and stuff. Right, so I need my crappy ninja to keep checking this place out. Actually, go, go over here. Okay, there's nothing there. Let's go that way again. You, you're gonna have to check out something around here. I don't have enough money to sabotage anymore. I could cancel something if I needed to. Ooh, they've got a full stack there. So here's the thing. If I, if I besiege this place, they could just run around me and take Setsu. Unless... Oh, I could actually I could bring up my second army just to quickly wipe them off the face of the earth. That probably isn't a bad idea. I can sabotage them because it's a very small army. Um, yes, I think I will wipe them off the face of the earth. Uh, yeah, let's check who I want to get the experience on. That's why I was hovering, right? So you need 14 more to level up. Level 5 is not super important. Level 6 or level 4 is a lot more important. So this guy is actually a little bit closer. So I'll do... I'll sabotage this. If I succeed, that'd be great. Nice. Right, so then you can attack this. And if I have enough movement, I'll attack and watch you with him as well. And he'll actually level up. Oh, I didn't. Hold on. Oh, I messed up. I messed up big time. I was supposed to besiege this first with the other army. Alright, well. Hopefully I still have enough movement. Ugh, doesn't look like it. Alright, I'll have to move out the general himself. Right, so now let's siege him out. Yeah, not enough movement. Alright, so we then do this. Wipe him out. And then, we stop the siege. This is very confusing. Then you besiege. And then you need to get your army next to you again. And that should be all in reinforcement range now. Or... Yes, okay. Right, and then we wipe them out as well, because I'm not going to wait for that siege. Alright, that was a bit confusing, but it works out. And now he's level 4. Very nice! Calm up. Wow, this is a terrible... This is completely unupgraded, what the fuck? Alright. Uh, infantry leader, please. And what do we got? Plus 1 command when defending, or plus 1 morale for this general's bodyguard. I'll take the uh, command over crap, but whatever. Right, then you're gonna go back in your army and leave now and never come back. Uh, actually, I might take this as well. Why not? You can't do anything against them, so let's go in here. They might actually still be able to run past me and go to Setsu, but if they do, then good for them, I guess. <laughs> Smart moves. Alright. I certainly want to upgrade some shit here, but I guess we'll do that with our money next turn. We got Courageous for our brother. Is he the one who was also... Um, I think he was also the one who had uh, Brave, didn't he? I guess he didn't. Was that someone else? No, yeah, it's because he's got plus one. Was it you? Plus four morale. Jesus fuck. Yeah, he's Brave. Where else are you getting that morale from? Plus four morale. Jesus. Okay, he's got one from here, and then one from Brave. Why does he have two more... Um, ...morale for all units under his man's command? No fucking idea, but that's pretty baller. How much morale have these guys got? Fucking 16. Even though actually got 13, alright. Uh, okay, cool. 17 on these guys. Fuck, these guys have higher morale by default than they do. Wait, so this is free. 17, 17. Now they have the same. I guess they're both technically um, samurai. Samurai. Uh, okay, cool. So that's that. So yeah, next turn I guess we'll... If, if this army doesn't do anything super annoying, we can go take out Ki, we can take Yamato, and then we have this whole situation here sorted. And then I'll put one army around here, 
and then the other army is going to start heading east. And then I want to try and not take any more towns, preferably. What about you? Are you any good? Uh, you have literally nothing special. Did I even give you a commission yet? I don't think I did. This guy got plus one. Okay, that's not bad. Uh, no, I never gave you a commission. You're the guy I got for free randomly. We've still got our air coming up as well. It's still not fucking doing anything. Uh, so we want finance. That's plus one percent clan by tax rate as well. So let's just increase our income a little bit. Although it's still 18%. It must have been on like 17.5. I mean, because there's the minus from it in a minute. Sorry? Administration cost. Or actually, yeah, no. I don't know. I was thinking maybe the um, character effects didn't come into play yet, but it does because it's right there. I don't know. Actually, 2890. What if I do that? No, it's still the same. Uh, anyway, it doesn't matter. Um, right, I think that's it for this turn. Is this place going to get... No, we're still not losing our clan white religion. You can move out of here and go into the other place, though. This is getting happier as well. So yeah, we don't need any units here anymore, but we don't have any units, okay. Uh, so let's get the monk over in there. And then this one unit that's here can get removed. And now we got plenty of happiness, and that should start converting pretty quickly as well now. For... So it's going up by 3.4%. That's pretty fucking slow still. We got, f we got a whole 4.0, like, growing religion. And yet that's only increasing it by, like, 3% per turn. That's ridiculous. Ridiculous! Anyway. And that turn. Look, Dante. If maybe if you invest a little bit more in military troops or even ships... You might do a little bit better. The Ito declaring war on me. What the fuck is wrong with you? Alright. Um, it's a little bit annoying. I don't want to pull the allies in because they'll just deny. Just gave me my just got me my join, but there's no no need to risk it. It wouldn't it doesn't matter much anyway, because the, they're declaring war on me and Knowing the AI, they just attack me and no one else. Are you gonna declare war on me again, Amako? I wouldn't be surprised. They got a bit of an army. Standing next to my town now. It's time for those ninjas. Oh, they didn't even reach. Which is good, because I think I might be able to wipe out their... Or take their towns and the army will disappear. If I can reach, which I think I will be able to. If not, I keep a ninja nearby so I can sabotage them. Oh, there go the Hojo. Can't say I'm super worried about them, because the two towns they've got here, they don't have any troops in. And I think they might have their troops here. If they even have anything remaining. But uh, it does mean that just in general things are looking slightly scarier because we are losing allies and we're gaining more enemies. And that of course will make the enemy think they can just walk all over me. Right, so yeah, we, it looks like we can reach Key and we'll be able to reach Yamato. So this army will disappear. Unless there's something in the way, but like I said, I'm pretty sure. Uh, uh, yep, take that. Level 5 from that, because I was reinforcing twice there, perfect. So that should be exactly level 5 then, actually. Yep, no, 2 experience extra, okay. Anyway, 1 point of Poets, Religious, and Honorable, and then we put 3 points in Inspirational as the finisher. Uh, repair that, I need to build some buildings, but we need to do that here too, so... Not sure what I'll do first. And then we take Yamato, and that should be the Atakiyama. Removed from existence. Goodbye. And their army will be gone. Oh shit. Okay, we're acclaimed now. That's yeah, not we're not Shogun yet, because then it would just trigger the cutscene. Okay, so basically I think we can take like four or five more towns, which I don't want to do, so we'll leave it here. But uh yeah. Alright. Uh I don't want a market here. I want to upgrade this stronghold, but now we definitely have more important things to do, like fertile soil here. Got that. Suck it in, I guess. Suck it in. And then we're out of money. Oh, that's literally all of our money. All Not literally. We have four left. Don't lie. Alright, uh, that place is going to be happy. Kawachi is... Not gonna... There was no mounting arrest there, right? No, it was Iga and Setsu. Right, so, but Iga's going to be fine. Setsu is not going to be fine. 
Uh, okay. So I'll need to get units in there or exempted from tax, which I guess will do that. Okay. Then uh, we have another, another monk who doesn't need to be in here, so I'm not going to put him in there. So I've got those two units here. They're going to be done next turn. Perfect. So they, I think we can even pick those up with this army on the way, and then we can remove three more units from here. Okay, so this monk is going to just go down in this direction for happiness. I don't want him in there, but over here somewhere. We can't get any further, so may as well go in there and get the extra free experience right now. You can't move anywhere. You can move out, but then I'll just leave this place unhappy. I don't think I need another market, so I might just remove this and build a Sake then instead. Just to speed up the process of becoming happy. Although, are you one of my richest towns right now? I wouldn't be surprised. Uh, no, there's seventh on the list, so no. Um, in that case, yeah, let's, let's demolish that. Alright. Uh, oh no, we don't even need to. Oh no, it's just gonna be... Because this is the Commissioner for Development. It must be. Yep. So yeah, he's making towns real happy as he takes them. So this place, I can move... I can actually move out right now. Because it's gonna be... It, we, we, start on the, we start on the lowest resistance to invaders we could possibly have. So we're gonna be on 16 happiness next turn, even if I move out. So, yep. Let's do that. Let's get the fuck out of here. We're on a timer here. Right, so I want to keep one ninja, one good ninja around here, and then we got one good ninja in the west. Who is going to... or sorry, in the east even. What the fuck am I talking about? Who's definitely going to start heading towards home-ish. Because I need to... if someone actually declares war on me right here, I need to be able to sabotage. This guy's only level 3. It's not as good as the other one in the west. In the west. In the west? Fuck me. And then... In one turn, we can start recruiting. Oh god, I'm an idiot. I don't have a sake den here yet. <laughs> god, hold on. Have they built the right one here? Nope. Um, okay, so I, I straight up can't recruit level three and then just yet because I haven't built a sake den. Do I cancel this and build a sake den? I think I will actually. I need. I'd rather get it one turn earlier. I can always build that later. So in two turns we can get level 3 ninjas, also decent. Uh, right, so you're gonna keep exploring around here. Ah, there's an army. There we go. Alright, so that, they're gonna be getting there pretty quickly. I'm not even sure if I can get there in time. I might need to send this army over there instead. Oof. That's rough, actually. I'm not even sure. Well, I guess we have a sabotage. It's going to be expensive, but... Yeah, we may need to keep you around here for that. Eh, if we lose our rematch, it's not the end of the world, to be honest. But, yeah, I try, I'll, I'll try and get there, but I don't think I can. Because uh, that's not the right way. So I, I need to get some information there. Yeah, I don't think we can get to our rematch unless I can sabotage them in time. But we will see. Um, right, okay. So, I've got no money, I want diplomacy, that's what I haven't done yet. So, Honma, you wanna trade? You broke trade again? Okay, fuck I you, I'm not gonna trade with you anymore. You keep betraying me like that. Miyoshi, you have war horses, so you're not gonna pay me. And then there's Sagara, who broke trade with me again. Was, yep, what the fuck's up wrong with all these people? Alright, let me see who wants to peace out. Kikawa, definitely not. Shogunate never wants to peace out. Date, come on man, what's the point? What's your point of being at war with me? Just spite? Uh, and I've tried all of them. Alright, that's it. I can't trade with anyone, except for the Miyoshi where I might be able to come to an agreement, but I don't have the money to pay him anything right now, so... Nope. Uh, Alright, cool. So I think that's it, actually, for this turn. The Shogun's Aya. I've still got a load of farms being built. Did I just, like, not build them in time? I'm not sure. I guess there's a bunch that I've, like, conquered where I'm upgrading it. Yeah, a couple of them. Anyway. End that sweet turn. Oh, Chosukabe. My most loyal ally. I am wondering when the Yamaka will declare war on me. Ooh, if they wait. No, they're not waiting. They're going straight forward. Okay, so I have to sabotage them or just not take it. 
Oh, nice. Yes! The Imagawa, man. Imagawa are definitely my most loyal ally. I can't believe the, uh, the way Sugi are still alive. If they take an hour, that's Satomi. They're both purple, so I think that might be Satomi. It'd be kind of wild if they take, took that somehow. Harima, Harima. Okay. Is that... It is the way Sugi. What the fuck? They've taken Kasusa out of... What the fuck is going on right here? Oh yeah, the Satomi is this one right here. Yeah, of course. They're, they are still... They are both purple, but that one's definitely lighter. More like a lilac or something. Is that a color? I don't even know. I'm not a woman. <laughs> That's racist. That's not racist. It's discriminatory. I'm sorry. I apologize to all the women watching. Or men. I t oh, God, I apologize to the world, I guess. I don't know. These days anymore. Can't say anything. Uh, right, so... I, there's no way I can get there. Uh, so let's, let's start moving, but... Because I'd like this army to get there, but yeah, there's no way. I could probably... Yeah, I could definitely get there next turn. So if I can sabotage them this turn, that'd be wonderful. 73%. Yeah, it's, it's about time, to be fair. We've, we've succeeded on almost all of them. The only thing is, am I going to lose fucking Setsu as well? No, we can definitely get this guy there. Right, so... I need this monk to do a little bit of scouting for me. Because I need my army to realize, oh, we can't actually go there. Um, yeah, so pop you in there. This is the, the worst army. Uh, especially to defend, because it doesn't have the extra good shit. I could probably, I mean, if I wanted to, I could run the cab over and knock up. Together with him, I could, but... Uh, there's always the uh, the small off chance that they're going to wait for their reinforcements, but, I, but I'm pretty sure even their reinforcements will be able to reach. You are going to try and sabotage this, because for 48% chance for 50 bucks, nice. Now you just need to fail twice and level up, or succeed one more time. Uh, okay. There's my three archers. We're going to start sending them over, since it looks like I'm going to have to wait... What would be the safer route? I guess this is probably fine. Some random Metsuke is gonna go pick him up. Right, any other buildings? Yeah, there's plenty of buildings I need to upgrade. Actually, ooh, that is very fertile soil. Um, I'd rather get this farm, even though it's a crap farm. He's a crap farm. Oh man, I could actually... Oh, I could get so close though. I didn't realize I can get almost there. It's not enough though. Well, Harima is going to rebel, so I'm going to let it rebel. <laughs> yeah, fuck it. Not my problem. And then Kawachi. Well, we got an army in there now, so that's not a problem. Okay, diplomacy. Anything changed in terms of trade or peace? Date. I, I need to kill, I need to fight the Date myself before they'd be willing to peace out. It's one of those annoying Shogun 2 things where because I haven't fought them yet, they're just never going to accept peace despite the fact that they're basically dead. What a tiger. Comes at your door. You do not invite him for tea. That is for friends. Or some, I don't know. I think I might be mixing up several uh, things now. You might be pay paying me a bit Speak of money though. Carefully. Hey, here we go. For my sword is ready to take your head. Jesus Christ. What the fuck have I ever done to you, my friend? Alright, they're willing to pay me at least four grand. Will you do five? Yes, you will. Will you do five and a half? You will not, you, you absolute bastard. Because these guys are probably going to die pretty soon, so any money I can get out of them right now would be fantastic. We do 5 free. Yes, alright, final offer 5 free 5. Son of a bitch, you just have to mess it up for me. 5 free 0. Alright, 5300 koku. You want to be my vassal? No. If you want to be my vassal, you're gonna have to fight my wars. Alright, that's good. You can upgrade some more shit with that. And then we've got, yeah, more trade, but no one wants to trade. Have I met everyone in the world yet? I have, haven't I? Yes, we've known, we, we know all the clans in the world. Cool. Right, well, let's upgrade some more shit here. That building's really not worth it, but... Uh, I guess I'll... Get this Burakuman village. It's actually not terrible in terms of money. I think Key is actually one of my richer towns as well right now. That's meager soil. Have I got any other farms that need upgrading? Yes, but no. Um, so I guess Ega it is. 
again, it's another one wealth per turn everywhere in the world, so it helps. Okay. I guess I could spend the money on recruiting units. I did say I was going to start doing that, didn't I? Didn't I? And then I didn't. How? Okay, we're two turns away from tax reform. Fuck me, I thought I'd be there by now. Ugh, absolute rip. Uh, you are going to go into a town where we don't have the highest happiness, which Key is certainly one of them, although that's, Key's going to be fine. Yamato is fine already. Kawachi is going to be fine as well, so I don't actually need you anymore. I don't need you anymore. I don't need to exempt this. I guess you need to be here for now. Alright, so we're going to lose Harima. I think that might be the first time we lose in this campaign. That's okay. Um... Did I move my ninja here? No. Alright, so we just started training with Satomi. They're not super scary. I think I'm gonna keep you around here. I, well, we are allied with your vassal leader, the wizard. So currently we can't actually be attacked by these guys, so no, we should actually be pretty safe. But you never know, do you? We have literally nothing around here. Well, not literally. I have two units around here, but that's not really units I'd want to use for a straight up war, so. Um, not by themselves, anyway. So, yeah, let's end the turn. Don't think I forgot anything. Oh, fuck me. The way Sugi's on a warpath. Jesus Christ, they're massacring people. How the fuck are the... <laughs> they're, they're just, like, in such a weird position. Like, how the fuck are they in the south now? Well, it's not south, but you know what I mean. Like, south of their starting position. On the map. Oh, and then people are going to tell me again. Dear Mr. Shimadonki, you know the map's not actually like this. This is actually the north. And blah, blah, blah. Fuck off. I'm talking about the game. I know the map in real life isn't... More, it's more vertical than horizontal. I'm aware of this. But in the game, it's not. And I'm talking about the fucking game. Am I not? Anyway. Sorry. So I'll go a little bit sometimes. Oh no, he's level 4 now. He's going to go for it. Fucking hell, he's actually going to go for it. What a bastard. Uh, Alright, well, I'll leave it here and I'll fight this one next time, I think. Um, but yeah, so the way Sugi just, like, they've, they've lost their starting province. They own Fukushima, which is bordering their starting province. But then they also own two towns nowhere fucking near. I don't think I don't think any of their towns border each other, by the way. I'm pretty sure all three of their towns have another town in between them, at least. It's fucking crazy. <laughs> they're all over the place. But hey, I'm, I'm happy they're still alive. They're doing well for themselves. Scrambling by. Uh, anyway, so this next time they have, they do have the archer advantage, no surprise there, we only have two archers. Um, but not, it's not that crazy, so we could probably just do the old tactic of trying to hide in the corner of the castle, depending on how big this castle is. Hide in the corner of the castle, make them all climb up, put up a yard wall, GG. Anyway, that'll be next time, so until then, thank you guys for watching, have a good day, and goodbye.